Now I'm going to show you how to change the angle setting in um, your calculator. You're going to need to do this during a test so that um, if you need it in radians or degrees, you can go back and forth. So on the home page, and if you, to get to the home page, just press on. Uh, go to press 5 for settings and then 2 for document settings or you can just use your trackpad and press it directly. Now you need to change it to either radians or degrees. I'm going to keep it on radians because um, in the next part we're going to graph a trig function and a linear function and find the point of intersection. And the only way to do that, to, um, to compare a trig function and linear functions, is if x is in radians. Okay, that's the only time we can do that. Otherwise, the um, degrees for the angle get too big, you know, 90, 180, 360, it's just too big. So we need to stick to um, smaller numbers which is why we stick to radians. And then you just press OK. And then you can do the rest, do whatever you'll need to do, a calculator or a graph.